what is up prince nation we are back for yet another dokkan battle well related video um so today what the data download for jp and global dropped last night um containing all the easy characters and stuff like that so today we are going to be talking about it uh this will be very quick i'm just gonna go over the four units um yeah so here's all like the characters stuff like that the animations and stuff the sprites the um the art these are the metals down here uh wait wait where's my oh there's my okay i didn't see my <laughs> yeah i didn't see my at first um but yeah so we're gonna go over the four easy a's i think they're mostly good but um let's start with tech trunks um i think he's i think he's all right like i think he's all right he's not bad i don't think he's amazing but he's not bad um uh stacks attack greatly raises defense for three turns in base i mean at least he does greatly raise defense that's that'll be helpful so you don't get blown off the field hopefully uh attacking defense 140 percent i like the two key to super class allies definitely uh additional attack that has a high chance of being a super chance performing a crit plus 30 percent within the same term with each attack performed i mean <clears throat> um I don't know. I'd have probably changed this for something else. Maybe. I don't know. I don't know. I would have probably changed that for something else. Um, so far, like in base, he's not super crazy. Uh, super Saiyan is where he gets really crazy. To All right. So Super Saiyan Trunks. He now stacks. Um, I apologize. Greatly stacks attack and defense. Um, this will be very helpful very very hot because he needs it he needs it he needs a couple of turns of stacking definitely and he, you know he's rng based too uh i'll show y'all that in a second uh 150 percent attacking defense that's cool superclass allies key too again that's great love that uh one key up to four plus an additional attacking defense was 25 percent up to 100 at the start of each turn so like the lr agl go on he gets stronger every time he's on the rotation um he launches an additional super attack that now has a 70 percent chance of becoming a super attack uh he'll launch an an another additional attack that has a high chance of becoming a super attack starting from the fourth turn from start of turn and then chance of performing a crit plus 30 percent within the same turn with each attack performed so the key here is he can he can super once then he can super again and then he can super again and then he can get the hidden potential attack and super a fourth time. All it is greatly raising attack and defense. 50% buff. A 50% buff on each one. I think Trunks has a very wide margin in my opinion. He can either look like dang near the best he are, Or he can look, he can sell you and look like, I don't know, Tech Vegito Blue. Like, he, look, I mean, the TUR Easy A Tech Vegeta Blue. Like he could just straight up sell you. It's 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 gonna be odd with this character. There are gonna you guys have to understand. This Trunks is going to sell you at some point. It's gonna happen. He's gonna sell you. Um, I I would personally say for this character, ooh, um, I could see going dodge. I personally say forget the crit forget the crit he, ha he has crit in his passive he has crit in his passive he has amazing crit in his passive forget crit i would say go for a mix of additional and dodge maybe a, a little bit so like 20 additional maybe and but throw like 10 dodge in there maybe just as like you know a, a, something to fall back on um yeah something to fall back on because you do want him getting that last super but i wouldn't say go all in on additional because just in case you know it, it could always end up being an additional normal and you get nothing out of it so i uh, you want to have that 10 dodge just as an extra like extra insurance let's that's what i like to think of like dodge kind of like 10 dodge three dodge five dodge stuff like that it's like a little bit of extra insurance right um and then on the next turn after he turns super saiyan he can go into his uh spirit bomb sword uh version 
Here he massively raises attack for one turn, so that's a hundred percent buff. He's gonna hit crazy with additionals. Uh immense damage to enemy and massively lowers defense. No one really cares about that, I'm not gonna lie. Uh so he's a nuking character just like before. Before he was getting 30% attack and 10% defense per key sphere obtained. Now he's getting 40% attack and 20% defense per key sphere obtained. He he outright performs crits. Like guaranteed crits. This guy will hit insanely hard. Insanely hard. Uh depending on how many orbs you get. But I've seen like I've heard people like using they probably use some shenanigans with Bulma, use her active skill with him on the rotation, transform with him, and then you put all that orbs into him instead. He would hit like a freight train, and his defense would be great too. Um, he has plus an additional attack, plus 50% when performing a super attack. The super class allies three key with four more key spheres obtained. That's not going to be too bad. Randomly changes key spheres of a certain type to tech key spheres. See, I like this. They took the once only out before it was once only which i always found to be very stupid uh they took that out thank god um over well okay let's go over his links super saiyan so in base in base saiyan warrior race saiyan lineage royal lineage messenger from the future dismal future prepare for battle fierce battle decent link set decent link set and then we go to super saiyan that changes a little bit obviously super saiyan golden warrior royal lineage messenger from the future dismal future prepare for battle fierce battle typical like future trunks links He's on so many categories, though. He's on, I think, 16 categories. And he'll help, like, Entrusted Will, Miraculous Awakening, um, Revenge, Bond of Master and Disciple, Vegeta Family. Like, he, he has spots. He has spots everywhere. Uh, these are his stats now. Uh, decent defense. Decent defense. 12,000 is respectable. 17,000. That's... Eh, not that, his stats are okay. His stats are okay. But, uh, yeah, that was the trunks. I th Oh, it's 12k multiplier is 150%. I did not know that. But, uh, that's the tech trunks. My opinion is, um, he's okay. He he's good. But just bear in mind, there's going to be times where this guy looks like God. And there's going to be times where this guy looks like Raditz. All right, that might have been a little bit too far. But there's going to be times he sells you outright, completely, 100%. So, be, like, be prepared for that. Be prepared for that. Um, next, AGL Zamasu. Uh, he's God. Now, he's actually just God. So, he sacks defense and the base Zamasu form. Already we won. Already we won. Attacking defense was 140%. Already we won. It's something to go with his damage reduction. We, are, we won. Already. Extreme class allies, two key. Beautiful. Love it. Reduces damage received by 40%. Recovers 10% HP at the start of turn and then recovers 20% HP at the end of the turn Like bro, he's Healing all over the place. He'll be reasonable defensively because he has the 40% here He stacks uh, Yo, he's good, bro. He's and this is just the base. Let's go to fusion Zamasu, right? Let's go to fusion Zamasu. He now stacks attack and defense uh, immense damage greatly lowers defense. Nobody cares about that part. Two key gives himself key. Wonderful. Attack and defense was 150%. Great. Again, he now has defense to go with that damage reduction. And I love it. Two key, stream class allies, same. Um, damage reduction by 50%. Now, before it was, yeah, it was just still 40%. It's 50% now. He's, he's, he's not going to take damage. He's not going to take a lot of damage. Absolutely not. Him and the tech. Uh, LR Zamasu, Tech LR Merge Zamasu is going to be a godly, ooh, excuse me, a godly rotation. Uh, plus an additional attack, plus 50% when performing a super. Launches an additional super attack within the same turn after receiving an attack. So that means throw him in slot one. But it's like you get a couple stacks in. He's got 150% defense. He has 50% damage reduction. There are times where you can just throw him slot one and he'll be fine. And then that means he'll double, maybe even triple stack. Uh, recovers 10% HP when HP is 90% or less. Fire. Covers 10% HP at the end of every turn. Every, yeah, every turn. Every time the character receives an attack five or more times. I, bro, he's great. He's great. His link set fits so well. Nightmare, Fuse Fighter, Big Bad Bosses, Godly Power, Dismal Future, Fear and Faith, Fears Battle. He fits great. He's helping out so many teams. Patara, Realm of Gods, Final Trump Card, Exploding Rage. 
world worldwide chaos he's so helpful and then we get to the mutated form which the wiki literally has it as mutation but whatever i'm not even gonna harp on that right now um so this one is just like pure damage this one is like pure damage uh he massively raises attack for one turn so that's 100 percent buff he's going to hit stupidly hard if he double supers uh immense damage or massively lowers defense no one cares six key so basically a guaranteed super because he's a tur he only needs 12 key to super so this is basically a guaranteed super uh 300 attack 100 defense he's still getting defense in this form he didn't get that lot uh before he didn't get that before that's great uh damage reduction received by 30 percent again before it was only 20 that's great uh plus an additional attack plus 50 percent and high chance of performing a crit when attacking so you don't need to give this character crit at all launches an additional super attack every time the character attacks two or more times in battle up to once within a turn so if he all right so if he supers right and then you attack wait right it's launches and just every time yeah every time the character just attacks so super normal he'll get a super after that or super super and then he'll get a super after that it, it, yo listen listen bro he's different he's different bro he's different uh plus an additional defense plus 50 percent when performing a super attack for three turns from start of turn i like how this isn't just on super attack for that turn he's have he has it for a little while the same enemies guard that's not that's eh, not really too crazy and super class enemies and allies attack minus 10 percent. this wouldn't affect you too much honestly but yo he's zamasu's different his stats buff is great like he has reasonable defense now like yo he's different this form right here is different bro he's different zamasu is like an a plus zamasu is amazing they and i'm so happy because they needed to nail this zamasu easy a they needed it tech lr merge zamasu needed it bad now he has his help now if we can get his name changed he'll also have the int one as well and they can all link together oh my god please change the name man it'll be all oh, the right that rotation will be so dummy oh my god it will oh man i'm so glad they nailed this zamasu bro i'm so happy all right next are the sub ecas we're gonna start with my um time travelers 130 oh i didn't even check the super i didn't even look at the leader skills for the other two characters uh trunks is future saga three key 170 per uh, yeah, 170 percent the stats or super class three key 130 percent the stats not a bad leader skill at all not a bad leader skill at all uh you could do this um what you call it in battlefield uh zamasu's realm of gods 170 percent three key and extreme class three key 130 percent again battlefield uh it's very strong very strong i love that uh my is time travelers three key 130 percent and int type uh three key and 90 percent not gonna use her as a leader so that doesn't really matter um now she gets defense on super before it was just a high chance to stun now she gets uh 30 percent defense on super attack along with um the high chance to stun i think that's a great addition uh 120 defense did she have that before oh she didn't she had nothing before uh so 120 percent defense uh attack plus 80 percent when attacking time travelers category allies 2k and 40 percent attacking defense is that the same that's the same okay they left out the same uh plus an additional one key and attack and defense plus 10 percent for characters who are also super class so the vegeto unit has a really good support unit to run with them now um high chance of stunning the attack enemy on the passive now as well oh that was already okay that was already there that was already there that's cool that's cool but she has two different chances to do it um when an enemy so like you won't really know which one it is until like the following turn if the enemy can attack the following turn after being stunned then she only got this but if he's he or she is also stunned for the next turn then she got the super attack one the super attack one is for two turns the one on the passive is for one turn remember that uh when an enemy is hit by the character super attack she now has a 70 percent chance to dodge from that enemy for the duration of that turn now th this is where you're a specific way great chance to uh the evading attacks from that enemy so let's say super battle road i super uh my super is android 18 it's an android 17 and android 18 fight 
she supers Android 18, she can only then have that 70% chance to dodge for Android 18's attacks. Android 17 will still work as normal against mine. But that's still, like, a lot of these tough fights are one enemy. So this is perfect. Bro, they snapped on this mine. And you'd probably be giving her dodge anyway. I think this is probably a character you go full dodge with anyway. Um, for the, uh, yeah, plus an additional defense was 80% when attacking. And, Jesus Christ. And force these enemies super attacks with when HP is 70% or less if there's a future saga category enemy. I mean, Dismal Future. That's a tough behind red zone. Uh, those stage, right? You know, you got at 17, 18, there, there are no slots when you get up to the final phase. Cell first form hits super hard. Goku Black is devastating. We're most likely gonna get a merge Zamasu. And it's like she has Scouter when your HP gets low. She has Scouter. It's bro, it's crazy. It's great. This Mai is insane. You go full dodge with this Mai, by the way. You go full dodge. She's not gonna be doing no crazy attacks out to nothing. You go full dodge with this Mai. Uh Battlefield Diva, Brainiacs, Cold Judgment, Solid Support, Dismal Future, Courage, First Battle. Not a terrible link set, not a terrible link set. She, oh my god, she will be so helpful to Pepe, to Peppy Gals. Uh, Future Saga, of course, she's she's gonna be a beyond a runnable unit. She's gonna be an amazing unit. Um, time Traveler, she, she everywhere. You can run her everywhere. Uh, her stats increase. Yeah, man, they, they snapped on this my. They snapped on this my. Oh man, they they went crazy. And then finally, we have Gwasu and Zamasu, uh, 130% uh, to Realm of Gods. Okay, so this is incorrect. Um, they do uh, greatly raise attack and defense for one turn. They forgot to add the C. I wouldn't think they would just lose uh, an ability when easy aim. I wouldn't think that would happen. So remember to add the ceiling to that too. They can also seal. Um, all allies, key three, 70% to defense. They gave a key. That's cool. Um, an additional one key in attack plus 30% for all allies when all allies second in the same turn are realm of gods category characters that's eh, not bad that's not bad that's not bad uh high chance to dodge so they didn't touch this they did not touch this from the base model they didn't touch that uh five key 140 percent attack and defense was 70 percent when attacking extreme class enemies i mean yeah cool um yeah that's cool Attack plus 70% and defense plus 140% when attacking super class enemy. Oh no. Bro, there's no. I, if they had reversed these, I think it would have been perfect. But there's no there's no super class enemies that are like really hard. Eh. And plus an additional attack and defense plus 70% when form is super attack. I don't know. I don't, I'm not a fan. I'm not a fan like that. But they're okay. I'm kind of mad that they didn't touch this though. I think they should have raised this to 70. If they they freaking gave my scouter and a 70% chance to dodge. Like, y'all could have did some with them. Uh, godly power, cold judgment, solid support, gentleman, more than meets the eye, brainiacs, and fierce battle. I mean, they're solid. I wouldn't call them bad, but they definitely, they. it feels like they held back with them a little bit. They could have did a little bit more. Uh, but yeah, those are all the easy A's. So I think Trunks, Trunks, is, Trunks is good. Trunks is good. Samasu's god. Maya's god. And they're okay. So overall, I think it was a pretty good batch of easy A's. Um, the tech trunks is weak to time travelers. Oh, it starts on September 1st. Um, yes, on September 1st. Uh, yeah, he's weak to time travelers. That shouldn't be too bad. And Zamasu is weak to battle of fate. That should be easy. Um, I believe there are missions to get some of the, what you call it. I believe there's missions to, um, get the easy A medals. Let me look up to see if it's said anywhere. Um, but I believe there are missions to get the medals. Uh, it doesn't look like he says anything, but I believe there are missions to like get the, um, medals for the sub easy a's as well while you're doing this so that's that's great actually that is great um does anybody mention it down here uh you won't have yeah okay you won't have to farm the extra medals for the sub easy a's they will be offered via missions okay perfect yeah 
you'll still get your same amount of stones, but you won't have to waste time going back to the sub easy A's, uh, trying to grind them up as well. You can do it all at once. That's perfect. But yes, guys, I uh, hope you guys enjoyed this video. Let me know down in the comment section below how you guys feel about the tech trunks, the AGL Samasu, the Int Mai, well, the Int Goat Mai, and the physical Gawasu and Zamasu. Um, like and subscribe, man, for more Dokkan Battle content such as this. I peeped 96% of y'all are not subscribed when y'all watch the videos. Come on, man. Let's get that. Let's bring that number down. Let's balance it out with the subscribe section. Let's balance it out a little bit. If you enjoy Dokkan Battle content, hey, man, you know, where to, you know where to find me. You know what the channel is. I'm going to catch y'all in the next one. I love y'all. Never forget that. I love y'all. Peace. Hey, appreciate you watching this video. If you're new to the channel, click the subscribe button and tap the bell icon to stay notified whenever I post a new video. Also, click the video on screen now to view content related to this video. Thank you for the support. Peace.